Here's a statement that I proved today in my abstract algebra class, which is actually useful to determine normality, uh, to determine that a subgroup is normal. Namely, that if you have a subgroup of a group that is of index 2, then H is automatically normal. Remember that normal means uh, that GH is equal to HG for all G in G. This theorem is actually used quite often in algebra, so let's uh, give a proof. Here's one proof. So it starts with a subgroup H of G of index 2. What that means is that the number of cosets of H in G is exactly 2. So there is just one element X in G such that G is disjoint union of H and this coset XH. Since this is, this is disjoint union of two cosets, this must be the complement, the set complement of H in G. So then G is H union G minus H. And now we're going to prove this condition that H is normal in G by proving that GH equals HG for all little g. So let's take a little g in g and compute the coset gh. That has to be one of the two cosets, h over g minus h, but if g is in h, then that is clearly h, so it has to be that it's that coset. Now, if g is not in h, then this cannot be h, so it has to be the other coset. So if g is not in h, it is g minus h. And if you take the right coset hg, then the same thing, the exactly the same thing happens, and what that means then is that GH equals HG in all cases, and therefore H is normal in G.